the point is infrastructure we know propels development. Infrastructure, you know, extends the life expectancy of people. Infrastructure supports education. Infrastructure adds value to people's lives. So sometimes you don't have the one year, the two years, the four years to discuss with the West, with the World Bank to get loans. When China is easily approachable to get the same loans. And that is why China will continue till tomorrow be a better option in terms of assessing some of these loans. Because you really don't, but the challenge is just with African countries. But the point is infrastructure is so, so important that we don't have all the time to continue to discuss conditionalities when people are actually dying. People are dying of poverty. People are dying of basic facilities. So you don't have all the time. And that was the point President Ward was making when he was saying two hours meeting with Ujin Tao was by far more useful than speaking with the leaders of the G8. And that tells you something. Infrastructure cannot wait for too long. People need infrastructure yesterday, not even today, yesterday. So if, you are, if they are thinking of getting it today, you won't tell them to wait for another one year for you to have some of these incredible conditionalities to be available before they can assess those infrastructure. They don't have those times. People don't have those times. African countries, people are actually facing a lot of real life problems. People are dying because of poverty. People are, you know, poverty is being multiplied across generations. So we don't have time to talk about some of these things. It is fantastic, but sometimes you want to see infrastructures that would, you know, pro propel development. When you don't see that, and when some of the countries that are saying that we don't need, you, you need to implement some of this, you know, good governance, which are fantastic stuff. In their own backyard, not, upholding some of these basic principles, then there is a serious problem. There is a very serious problem.